Let us join together in prayer on Palm Sunday. O oh God of joy and celebration, enter into our lives as Christ entered into Jerusalem. He rode into the city on a lowly beast, victorious through love and not through violence. Help us to learn the meaning of power and wholeness through Christ, who is willing to serve and share our human life and sufferings. Amid the clamor of demands, help us to follow your will for us. It is wonderful to receive praise and support from those around us, but let us make sure that we take the time to listen to your voice. We want to experience the celebration of Easter and get your ways by the cross. So help us to remember the humility of Jesus, and may we live humble and compassionate lives. Many in our congregation have witnessed great turmoil in their lives due to the loss of loved ones or the onset of a serious illness. As we listen for your word and seek to follow you, give us the strength to be faithful disciples. Together as the body of Christ, may we live in your spirit and learn to value and respect the gifts that you have given to each one of us. May the tie that binds us become so strong that we seek to be faithful to everyone around us as we seek to do your calling. With the spread of the coronavirus, our lives have changed and we have learned that there are some things we cannot predict or control with any clarity. But as we are filled with anxiety and fear and uncertainty, may we also be aware of your calming and all-consuming love and presence. As we work in maintaining our physical distance from each other to ensure a healthy community, may we not stay distant in terms of our care for each other. We can never forget that in the midst of all the trials Jesus faced, he showed us the value of living with compassion. We pray for our world, and we ask that your healing presence be felt by all who are recovering from the coronavirus, and be with those who are grieving the loss of loved ones. May your presence and concern be felt by all who need your comforting presence. In a desire to respect life, may we be honest about our human limitations in discerning your will. We thank you for health care providers and for all who have occupations that are putting themselves in harm's way. May we express our gratitude on a daily basis to them. And be with all political leaders and administrators who are making decisions that will literally affect the life and death of others. May egos be set aside so that we do not have to fall further behind in meeting this crisis in our country and world. Help us all to work together and support each other so that your way of life can flourish. Oh God, we are grateful that we are a people with a history. We can build upon wisdom from the past and join with others who have taken the time and commitment to place their trust in you. And so we join now in praying the prayer that Jesus taught his disciples. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory forever. Amen.